Hi, this is Stephen from Owner Disown. As you know, AMD has taken the world by storm with its Ryzen 4045 watt lineup, leading to many conspiracy theorists to believe that the OEMs are intentionally sabotaging the lineups to help keep Intel ticking over until they release perhaps their 7 nanometer chips. Well, AMD releases three new Ryzen Pro 4000 CPUs today for corporate use. The big feature for them is full memory encryption. All three Pro CPUs will have hyper-threading, with the top Ryzen 7 Pro 4750U having 8 cores and 16 threads, 7 Vega graphics cores clocked at 1600MHz and maintaining a 15 watt TDP. Compared to the U series, you will see that the clock rate of the Pro series is slightly lower and the 4800U has one more graphics core and is clocked 150MHz higher. Performance-wise, the U series should be slightly better, especially since the OEMs can configure them up to 25 watts. Lenovo have already announced their ThinkPad T14, the T15, and X13 and L series with prices starting at $649, which will be available later this year. These are geared up for larger companies, with features such as modern standby where the laptop is in lower powered mode and still syncing in the background and the ability to wake using your voice. Now compared to the previous Pro 3000 series, we see about 132% gain in multi-threaded performance and a 13% gain in graphics performance. These are designed for the small to mid-sized businesses. They have an improved design with a screen to body ratio of 85%, a fingerprint reader and optional IR camera that can lock the computer when the user is away. With Harman branded speakers, dual array microphones and Skype for business hotkeys integrated into the keyboard, it is all set up for the modern age of online communications. Now ThinkPad laptops are built tough and undergo 12 military spec tests for durability and their keyboards are best in class. And pricing only starts at $639 on the E14 and all units will be available in June 2020. And Intel should be worried. I did test the 6-core i7-10710U CPU and it was not too far away from the 9750H but the Ryzen 7 Pro U beats it in most applications. So it is good to see OEMs like Lenovo and HP adopting these low-powered AMD chips. AMD is touting up to 20 hours of battery life with these new Pro 4000 CPUs, which you know is no doubt is rather generous, but we should expect at least 10 hours. There is also the IdeaPad 5, the 15-inch and the 14-inch, which uses Ryzen 7 4000 new processors. So we have great options now. And with the integrated graphics, it should still be able to play games like Fortnite and Overwatch quite okay. When I look at the new Surface Book 3 lineup, I am left a bit disappointed in that they have only 4 core Intel CPUs. True, they have dedicated Nvidia GPUs up to a 1660 Ti Max-Q, but the pricing is absolutely crazy. Let me know if you would like me to review any of these uh, new 4000U series laptops in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Bye now.